I'm happy to have with me here today Mr. Wilson Lee, who is uh, Director of IT at Kerry Logistics. Um, Wilson is going to talk to us about the challenges around new applications for the mobile platform and how to develop and how to customize applications for a mobile environment. So Wilson, um, tell us a little bit about your mobile environment. Um, how many of your workers and staff are mobile today? What sort of devices are they using? Okay, right now we have two, um, two ways of using mobile technologies. The first one is, is just like some other corporations for mobile email and communications mm. that include emails, voice, and also some uh, information retrieval while they are on the road. The other one is uh, more on the operational side because we are on the logistics business and logistics is talking about one of the business unit is about transportation. And for example, in Hong Kong, uh, we use mobile technology for what we call electronic proof of delivery. Mm. That is to use mobile technology, wireless technology, to enable the communications for the delivery man when they complete the delivery. They use mobile device, they use wireless technology to to send the signal, the status change, back to the host. So two, two ways of using mobile technology at the moment. And beyond the email and, and some of the existing supply chain applications mm -hmm. you have, um, do you have any other applications in mind that you would like to put onto the mobile devices? In fact, a lot. Uh, uh, we, we are starting up a new initiative on CRM uh, to put some uh, both statistic, uh, statistical data and also some contact information, some uh, quotation information onto the uh, CRM platform while the users uh, in future, they can have an access to this CRM platform with their mobile device. That is one of the major initiatives. And the other one is a lot of office automation initiative, including workflow approval, and also uh, a lot of uh, uh, office automation stuff. For example, we retrieve a document from our, from our document imaging server, and then send it out through fax and uh, other channel through their mobile device again. So that is uh, on the, on the uh, general use uh, side. But in the future, we want to make use of some mobile scanner. And in fact, we are testing one uh, mobile uh, Bluetooth mobile uh, scanner connecting back to mobile device like, like the BlackBerry because we have a lot of obsolete BlackBerry model. Mm. So we deploy the BlackBerry obsolete model to the operation unit so that they can make use of the BlackBerry connect to a Bluetooth um, scanner to scan the product, to scan the barcode on the delivery note. To, to update the, the POD status. Okay. Just one final question. Um, for, for other companies looking to deploy mobile applications, um, what advice would you give them in terms of them trying to find applications that they can deploy? And also, what potential pitfalls may they face in sort of rolling these applications out to their mobile users? Okay. I would say the most important point is... Uh, to to make sure you have the right business case mm -hmm. and then to have the right business application. It's not about the, the mobile technology, it's not about GPRS, it's not about GPS, it's not about all the Wi-Fi stuff. Mm. I would say uh, up to this moment all these, all, these, all these platforms are quite ready and what we need to focus on uh, from a business perspective is the justification to put things on a mobile device. Mm -hmm. And also, I always emphasize that mobile is not just talking about the mobile device. So it's a combination of mobile, web, and, and put the right application onto, the, onto this platform okay. to enable the business. Great.